So the piece I'm creating for NEBT is called Domino. So it's based on the concept of the game of dominoes. The game is all about matching pieces um, and matching the numbers. So I'm playing with the idea of matching with a partner in life. Uh, also matching choreographically, whether it's mirroring movements, symmetry, asymmetry, but then finding your match, whether that's your love or your companion. Using six dancers, as with the six dot formation on a domino, and actually the, both the opening and closing sequences play with the building up of those numbers. So the solitary one in the centre, the two, the three, the four in each corner, the five and the six. This piece is really driven by concept. So I've got kind of a range of ideas that I've come with into the studio, but then I'm just building on it with the dancers. Within each piece, I have tried to leave myself and trust myself to have that freedom to explore and see where the piece will go. And, and I think that's what's so brilliant about something like this choreographic lab is, is to have time to play, to have time to experiment and build. And I'm at that stage as a choreographer where I've just kind of stepped out to pursue this full time. It feels like a step outside of my comfort zone because I'm working with dancers that I haven't worked with before. The dance have been a real inspiration and they're all very kind of eager and like sponges ready to take in everything and rehearse right to the end and repeat and which is really inspiring and it feels very supportive. I think it's really important that opportunities are given to developing choreographers to just experiment, try ideas. It's a challenge because I'm working in a very short time frame but there's also something that's really inspiring about that because you have to gain momentum and push forwards and, and just trust yourself to keep going. So it's, it's been a really, really good opportunity for me to develop as a choreographer.